Hello student, in this class we learned wireframe rendering. So first I open material editor window. I use this material shader for wooden table and this for tablecloth and this floor. First I create a map. So I choose this shader in the second row and then click on this button. In the material map browser window, we can only access materials. Map is not listed here. So I close this. To access material and map in the same window, click on this button. These are materials and these are maps. In the map, click on the earn all and find utility. Click on this utility and find utility. Double click on this. Utility map is applied here. I create one more map. So I select this and then click on the wireframe. It's similar as utility map and wireframe map is also created. Now close this material map browser window, select utility map. These are parameter of utility map in the color mode, select color or you can also choose different different color theme from here or you can also change color from here also. In the shade mode, select Lambert and in the overlay mode, select polywire. Now we can use this map on a surface. So first I select a shader and then select this and apply a Arnold standard material. Now select this map and click and drag in this box. So I click and drag and choose instance. Now you can see the preview of this material. Now I apply this material on this tablecloth. So I select this and then apply. Material is applied. Now click on the render button. You can see wireframe in the render window, but the only problem is this, it show in a triangle form. Now we try our second map that called wireframe and check the result with that map. So I close this and select the wireframe map. And the first parameter in the wireframe map is as type currently set on triangle and you can also choose polygons. And the next parameter is fill color. You can change by clicking on this. And you can also change the line color or line width from here. Now I apply this map on this shader. So first I select this shader and then right click and clear. Now click and drag and drop in this box instance and OK. Now you can check the preview in this window. Tablecloth is selected. Now I apply this and then render. After applying wireframe map result is same. There is no change. It's also show the triangles, but we can fix this. First I select and move this window in the left side, then click on the modify button and then click on the modify drop down list. And in this list, click on the Arnold properties. Arnold property modifier is applied on this tablecloth mesh. Click on the subdivisions and enable this. Now I render again and check. Now wireframe show in a quad form, but the problem is this poly count is not similar to the original geometry. Now I go to Arnold property modifier again and in the subdivision alternation value one is applied. So it's provide a smoothness. You can also check on this edge. It's quite smooth. I set this alternation value to zero. So I right click on this up and down arrow. Now it's set to zero. Now render again. Now you can check this edge of cloth is not smooth that was earlier. Now wireframe mesh is same as original mesh. You can also use this modifier with utility map. I show you. First I delete this and clear this wireframe map by right click and choose clear. Now click on this utility map and click and drag. Utility map is applied. Now render again. Now render is in triangle form. Now click on this modify list and choose Arnold properties and in the subdivision enable this and set alternation value to zero and then render. Result is same. I hope you understand how to render your scene in a wireframe. You can also use these map with the map to material shader. So first I select a new shader and then click on this button in the Arnold material find utility and in this click on this map to material 
ओके टू कनेक्ट दिस यूटिलिटी मैप टू मैप टू मेटेरियल शेडर क्लिक एंड ड्रैग इन द नो मैप बटन इंस्टांस एंड ओके मैप इज अप्लाई नाउ सेलेक्ट दिस टेबल क्लॉथ एंड अप्लाई दिस एंड क्लिक ऑन द रेंडर बटन नाउ यू कैन सी द रिजल्ट मैप टू मेटेरियल शेडर आई होप यू अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू यूज यूटिलिटी एंड वायर फ्रेम मैप and the use of arnold property modifier and we also discuss map to material shader if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel and like this video